The third of Ohio's three wartime governors is John Bruff, who succeeded David Todd in 1863. Born in Marietta, Ohio in 1811, Bruff was orphaned at age 11. He worked as a printer and, at age 14, was able to fund three years of part-time education at Ohio University, where he would later serve as trustee. At age 26, he began his journey into politics, serving first as a state representative before becoming auditor for the state of Ohio. During this time, he founded the Cincinnati Inquirer in 1841. Bruff sold the Cincinnati Inquirer in 1848 and moved to Cleveland, where he began working for the Bellefontaine and Indianapolis Railroad. By 1863, the reigning political factions in the state had grown displeased with the leadership of Governor David Todd. Looking for a new candidate more strongly opposed to slavery, the National Union Party in Ohio persuaded Bruff to run for governor against Clement L. Vallandigham, leader of the Copperhead faction. Bruff won the election and took office in January of 1864. As governor, Bruff accelerated the raising of troops and was a strong supporter of the Lincoln administration. After Lincoln's assassination, Bruff was one of only a handful of governors to accompany the funeral train. In 1865, Bruff suffered a fall on the Ohio State House grounds and died in office shortly thereafter as a result of infection. His body was brought back to Cleveland where he was buried at Woodland Cemetery.